I know I can't go back, but let me tell you, if I could, I would tell myself not to be afraid of my players being silent after I ask them, what do you want to do? Oftentimes, dungeon masters have a fear of silence, and this can be for many reasons. However, I'm here to tell you, silence is not a bad thing. The awkward silence of anxiety, the thunderous silence of a revelation, and the IDK silence of your players just trying to think of what to do. So them being silent is them actually thinking about what they want to do, so give them a little bit of time to think. And the little trick that I found out is that after you ask them what they want to do, start counting to seven in your head. If no one's answered by then, you can repeat the description and ask the question again, and then start counting to ten with your hands. Um, and they'll get the picture that they need to do something soon or something's going to happen. And if they don't start talking and make decisions or just like start talking and say what they want to do with, by the time you get to 10, you got to escalate via like an NPC or like an accident or something, maybe a skill check or the classic roll for initiative. Anyways, I hope this helps. Just remember, silence is the player's thinking, so give them time to think. I'm Craig of Inspiration. Good luck on your next session. I believe in you. See you in the future.